series is all about penetration. This first strike that I'm going to be doing is using my elbow in the solar plexus. I basically want to just bury my elbow as deep as I can. I want to go through his back. I'm really thinking about hitting him on the other side of his solar plexus from behind. I want to just drive my elbow right through him. You have to have full commitment in something like this to be able to get the reaction. So when I first come in, I come in and I strike from here. Now I'm penetrating right through. As you can see, everything's aligned right here. My second strike is I'm going to come striking up and basically just crushing, crushing the windpipe here with, between my bicep and my forearm as I grab the head. I duck right back down into it, he flips over, and he's going to be slamming on the concrete here. I've got one slam on the concrete, I then switch and I take him, I want, to go, I want him to go this way, I grab him by the hair and the chin, wrench his neck over. Good chance if, if he doesn't move fast enough, I'm going to do high damage to the cervical here. At this point, I want to get another shot into him, I take the head up and I slam it again in the concrete. I just want to just take basically the nose, the chin, whatever I can get here and get an extra shot for additional head trauma. At that point, I stand, I'm looking, my targets are the solar plexus and the neck at this point. Be extremely careful. When you are practicing this on your partner, what you need to do is you need to cheat to the solar plexus side. You have to go really light when you're dropping your knee on somebody's neck. So when I go down, I go down slow and delivered. I'm really looking at my solar plexus target. I come down, I'm trying to keep as much weight over me without hurting my partner. Now I'm 220, so I have to be very careful with Ron here. So I'm here and I'm placing it. This is what it looks like when you execute it. This is what it's going to look like dynamically when you actually do it. And you don't want to do that in your training partner.